This video is for setting up your Digisol DGHR3300TA broadband home router for internet connection and enabling wireless security. Your Digisol router is an excellent choice for small or medium homes and allows you to create up to three separate wireless networks, namely for your home, relatives and guests. Also, it can be used as a universal repeater to extend the range of any existing wireless network. You can schedule the internet access for everyone in the family. You will get quick and uninterrupted wireless connectivity via auto channel sensing. Plug the power adapter in the wall socket and connect the other end to the power connector on the router. Connect your cable modem to WAN port of the router by an Ethernet cable. Please ensure that your laptop or desktop is set to obtain IP address automatically. DHCP enabled. Yes. Connect to the Digisol wireless network from your computer system tray. A web browser will open automatically. Click on OK. On the next configuration page, click on Connect. The default username is Admin and the password is 1234. Click OK to continue. The setup wizard will begin. To set up the internet connection, click on WAN. Select the DHCP option if your internet provider assigns a static IP or select the triple PoE option if your internet provider requires a username and password for the connection. In this case, we are using the triple PoE option. Enter the username and password provided by your internet service provider and click on save or apply. Click on the status tab to see if your link is up and you are connected to the internet. In order to secure your wireless connection, click on wireless. Click on security. Select the WPA or WPA2 personal option in the security mode. In the WPA settings, select TKIP or AES from the WPA algorithm. Then type your desired password in the passphrase box. Click on save and apply. You can check in your computer system tray that your wireless connection is secure. Select the wireless Digisol connection, enter the password and click next. We recommend you to change the password of the router configuration page too. In order to do so, log in to the configuration page using existing credentials. Click on advance, then password management. Type the new password and confirm it. Click on save. You will now see the notification to reboot your router. Click on reboot and wait while the reboot process is completed. You are now securely connected to the internet. Only share the password with people you know.